hello friends welcome to the, my youtube channel in this video i will show you how to set up the qt application or how to deploy the qt application or how to copy the all the requirement dependencies file automatically in our qt execution folder so let's simply make first simple application let's add one push button control and now build the application wait for the build so you can see we need to add qt core dot dll or qt gui application dll or qt widgets dll because it is a basic common uh, dependencies to run the qt application so just simply copy the, the that dependency from your kit folder which is are using for your application and in that bin folder so just simply find the both uh, those DLL and copy to your folder execution directory. Now copy the widget. Okay. Add here. We also need to add the plugins directory. Plugins of the our application. So simply copy that uh, plugins folder. Here you can see the platforms and see our application is run. So this is the manual process we, where we have to find the all just dependencies and copy the one by one in our execution folder. So now let's make this process automatically. So simply open your header file uh, profile and write the this code. Just simply write write the config and pass your uh, build system debug or release release okay and here you have to provide the destination directory dash dir here equal to where our present working directory where we have to show out slash pwd slash debug or in else part if you working with release so just simply change debug to here release okay now use qmic flag to write the post link here is showing the something error this is a unexpected else okay just we have to write this format okay Okay, so this error was solved and now write the code over to copy the uh, directories uh, of our required dependencies from our bin directory to our execution directory. Just simply write to here where our Qt win deploy application is located bin win deploy qt.exe. You can see our application is located in bin directory bin deploy qt.exe okay now write the code shell code equal to our destination directory dash write our targeted part okay now here we call the no compiler this runtime okay so we just run the our win deploy qt application and copy the all the directories required directories in our destination directory which is defined here now let's run the application 
first of all clean the project now just simply remove these files okay now call the run queue make and build the application wait for the build you can see the all the requirement required dependencies files are copied in our execution directory and simply just run the application so you can see the application is run successfully if we remove the styles plugins so you can see the style has gone or if you push button style sheet has gone and after C you can see the effect of that style plugins so every plugin says its own properties and uh, use so just simply write this code and automatically use copy the all the requirement direct uh, dependencies in your execution folder and after that you can easily deploy this qt application so please drop your comment if you have any questions about how to deploy the qt application or how to set up the qt application and Please like the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video with your friends and thanks for watching my video. Thank you.